Hi, <laughs> good afternoon everyone. Happy Wednesday. Are we getting ready for Thanksgiving? Yay! Yay! The camera is there if you oh, need it. Yes. We forgot about that. Okay, I have a couple of ideas for Thanksgiving uh, dinner. Please stay safe. Please stay home as much as you could. Okay. <clears throat> What I'm going to show it first is that I am going to put my ham in our pressure cooker. Yes, our ham in pressure cooker. I know you could cook it. Um, what I did is that even if it's cooked, I still cook myself my uh, ham. So I got <clears throat> my ham and I. you guys could see that I put it in, I poked it in. Uh, the cloves, 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 and then I put cinnamon in and at the bottom as well too. You could add it if you want a pineapple, or you could have it added up <coughs> brown sugar. I like to put brown sugar in there. <coughs> it's sort of it's car car caramelize it. My English today. Oh my gosh! So I'm going to put a one third cup of <clears throat> brown sugar okay as you guys could see it's not full uh, rock in there i'm going to be like as you can see i am they're nice and fluffy my brown sugar i'm going to put on it sort of like this i will just show it to you guys soon Voila, check it out. It's all covered with brown sugar and and there's a cinnamon and glow. I'm, I'm not going to put any, um, I'm going to put only a little bit of water to, to make it start cooking. I will say I will put it a quarter cup of water, sort of, yep and that's it it's all done and i'm going to put it in the microwave for for nine minutes okay it's it's going to go in the microwave for nine minutes Tupperware thinks of everything. Yeah, and I'm going to put a little bit of 25% um, cream. I love it. The reason why I do love it is it's nice and tasty. Ooh. So our masher is, what I did is that I cut the potatoes and put it in microwave for seven minutes in vent and serve. You could do that, no water, nothing. Yeah, it stays in there nicely, and you could put it in a big bowl and mash it. You could mash it as much as you want it, as little as you want it, 
as well. See, mashed potatoes are done nicely and we will, we will plate it later on. See, as you guys could see it, you could do in a, on a stove too, but personally I do it in the microwave. The reason why I do it is that it's easier and faster. Uh, I don't have to boil the pot. I don't have to wash it. See, I cooked it in here and I could even serve it directly from here. Yes, that is why I like to use my microwavable Tupperware dishes. So this is our vent and serve line. I prepared something ahead of time. This is what happens. Yeah, hold on. There we go. Okay. See? Magic of television. Let me wash my hands for a second. Okay, anyway, we will take care of it after. It's only oil. Yes. I wanted to do a be ahead of time. Ahead of thing. Okay. So let's put this one away. Now, after mashed potatoes, I was planning. Let me see, where is my thing? Okay, cake. Last week, I did prepare a cake. Um, oh, before I go there to cake, I wanted to talk a little bit about our rent and serve. Our rent and serve, we have different sizes as well too. This, this is, I call it as a working set that you could use it at, at home, you could use it at work. You, uh, uh, portion control, this is the cup and three quarter, two and a half cups and three and a half cups. And for metric folks, 400 milliliters, 600 milliliters, 800 milliliters. Thank you, sir. Okay, what we have it here, as you guys could see, there are four uh, sexy legs that it's high elevated and cooks it evenly. The product does not get hot. The food gets hot in there. And then you, you seal it. You could put it in the fridge, in the freezer, and next day you could use it and serve it. So that is our vent and serve. Uh, you guys know about our pressure cooker as well too. We have been talking last oh, every month, every day I, I, I guess. Our pressure cooker is cooks faster and then there is a two, 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 two safety that extra pressure will come out and then you could cook it nicely in there from a ham or a roast and then and then you could use it. This is a silicone ring that it goes and locks it nicely. This is our pressure cooker. You guys know that, did you guys realize I didn't use a, a, a product today, our chopper? <laughs> yeah, I didn't. And I'm not going to use it today. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to use my whipper, whip and prep. See, as you guys know, it, it uh, whips it, it goes from one to two. One is if something fast, two is something if it's a doughy. And then it's easy. See, this is locked right now. If I turn around, unlock it, and then it is, uh, what you call it? Take it off and wash it. Okay, what I'm going to do, what I need here, this is, for this cake, oopala, I'm clumsy today. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Thank God I use Tupperware. I am. Uh, I need my book. I'm going to use it, my stack cooker today, for cooking my apple cake a la root. Yes, mm. this is my recipe, my creation. I'm going to use that. But I had got some other recipe i'm sort of mixing it up together okay that's why i'm following it up that so what i'm going to do i'm going to put four eggs okay
Four eggs, no shells. Yeah, Babu, how did you know? <laughs> wow, my smart husband. Okay, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to put it in like this. No, this is the wrong way. Okay, this way. This back part has to go in like this. Yep, it's there because it's uh, eggs. It's easy to turn it around. That's number one. Okay, now then I'm going to add in here. I am going to add in here. See, you do like this. Everything on the on the on, on the whisk, it comes down. So, what I'm going to do add right now, I'm going to add a butter, uh, room temperature butter. It is a quarter cup. I like the, in fact, by mistake, my husband got this. Uh, for me, they were on special, but I love it when it's single, singly uh, wrapped. Mistake. So, I mean, there's a, I think it's a mistake. And a quarter. It worked out. It worked out very well. And a quarter cup of oil. Okay. That's why I prepared it ahead of time. Now everywhere is a. Okay. What else do we need? I need in here two cups of flour. Okay? I'm going to put two cups of flour. Uh, in fact, I have it one cup, but like this it's easier. It's a half a cup. One. Okay. And I'm going to put another half because see what happens when I measure it stuff. Okay. So that is done. And two uh, tablespoon of baking uh, no teaspoon of baking powder. And then we have it uh, one cup of sugar. And then I'm going to mix it all together. Maybe we get that flour container out of the way. Okay, sir. Thank you very much. So, so it is all here. See, it is very hard to move because it's number one. Now I'm going to do number two. See how easy it gets? First one, it didn't even move it. The second one, it is all done. What I'm going to do is, see the dough? Nice and buttery. What you do is that you just go backwards, turn around, and then it, it does clean it. See, it gets faster. Hoppala, come on Ruth. Okie dokie. So, what I'm going to do is that take the spatula. See? I'm going to add in here. I put my cone in there as well too to make a nice um, 
cakey look like a bomb cake this is a thick 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 dough it's thick it is thick okay I hear you Sort of, you could see it, it is done. I'm going to add in here a cup and a half of apple, apple sauce that I did make it, prepared it ahead of time. See, now you know why, why? We buy a, fruits and vegetables in season and we store them in Tupperware, freezer yeah. or refrigerator. And then plus, the dough is thick because of I'm putting the applesauce in there. That's the reason. I'm going to add a little bit more of on top of uh, applesauce, some cinnamon vanilla. As you guys could see, it is all down there. Yep. Now I'm going to add the rest of the dough on top of my Yes, Donald, are you going to say anything? I uh, wasn't planning on it, but I just said... to recap, we've got the, the dough on the bottom, we've got the applesauce in the middle, we've got the dough on top. Yes. Okie dokie. And everything is in a Tupperware stack cooker with the cone in the middle. Yeah. Now, remind everybody what the purpose of the cone is. The cone is because, see, and I'm going, I'm just twisting around here. Okay. Okie dokie. I will show it. The reason for the cone is that microwaves attack, microwave attacks flesh and uh, water and it cooks faster. That's why what happened is that the product does not get hot. So the pro the waves could go through it. So it goes from here to here and goes back, bounce it back. So all this in between cooks it evenly. To cook it evenly, we need this. And then I'm going to put this aside. And I'm going to put in microwave for eight minutes. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to use my stack cooker like this put it in the microwave for eight minutes meanwhile my ham is done and it's there this goes in okay what do we need what do we need for uh, uh, your mashed potatoes on the side? Uh, you need a cranberry sauce. Make a homemade cranberry sauce. Yes, you could make your homemade cranberry sauce. What you do is that you could take, which I did earlier, I took a quarter cup of um, uh, quarter cup of uh, sugar, quarter cup of water. I boiled it like this in a microwave for three minutes. Then I took my fresh cranberries. Okay, they are fresh cranberries. What I did is that I put it in here with the sugar. After it boiled three minutes, I put a minute and a half, they popped up. Once they popped up, you just mix it 
all together and guess what I did add it up myself this is what it, it this took. was the result this is the result and what happened is that I put it in there as cinnamon I love it because it's cinnamon it gives a nice and then I put some uh, cloves in there too and mm, very good so what you need to do is that give that little bit of a twist. What you have to do is have a a lime, a lime, a squeeze a lime in here. A little bit of lime juice, like I do have, like which is a lot of juice coming up. It's a half a lime, and voila. You have your own homemade cranberry sauce. Yes, cranberry sauce is done. And you could leave it, see here, inside there is the, the cinnamon sticks, which I boiled it with the sugar. What happened to it is that leave it in your fridge, you do it overnight, and then you could use it as well too. And it does taste amazing. I love it, a little bit of like limey juice. That is me. Okay, this is done too. Oop. Cranberries are done. Potatoes are done. Now we have to have, and the dessert is in the microwave. So we have to have now our vegetables. Yeah, very easy. Do you guys remember um, almonds? Uh, butter with butter I does uh, just caramelize it a little bit I'm going to leave it here for now like this then I'm going to to add I'm going to put some broccoli here okay I cut them in the parts see I have some here the steam the steam that I don't put it in like this see what I'm going to do now I'm going to use my mando chef to have a nice slice. Okay? I'm going to put this, the steams, the steams you see? Stems. The stems in there. See, we don't throw anything out. Like this. See? We have a small that it cooks nicely. Nothing to throw. Never. Here, what do I have here? I have another one here. I don't have this and this and this. See? Opala. Then I'm going to add my carrots. You could peel your carrots or you don't peel your carrots. It's your choice. If you wanted to peel your carrots, let me show you how our our peeler is. You just do it like this. See how, how good is our pillar is? Amazing. Or you could do like this. Depends how you peel it, you know, yourself. And our pillar is amazing. What you do here, take it up. Have a bowl inside the bowl you have this then when your carrots are see I'm going to do this too Let's finish it up. It's two carrots 
as much as you want. I like it some color and it's I steam my vegetables in the microwave with my almonds and butter. Voila, this is done too. Check it out. All nice and uh, slicey and it cooks even faster. Voila, I'm going to mix all this here. You know what? I think I need a bigger one. Uh, I will put it in here nicely. That it will be easy to mix it nicely with the butter and almond. It's all in there. as well too so let me clean it for a second my mess I know I don't I like to work a little bit cleaner okie dokie so this is all done here what I'm going to do now is that Let's open and see our ham. Oh, I, as you guys could see, I could hold it like this. And here is very, very hot. And as you guys could see, the, the steam is not there. And then let's check it out together. Mm, it smells so good. Nice. As you guys could see, there is a juice on it uh, inside. It's the, and caramelized nicely. And then we could cut it and then serve it. Yes. And I could, you could use our cutting board nicely. See, it's all nicely, all I had put it in. And you could use this sweet to water if you want to. If you don't, you could dump it. Check it out. You could cut it nicely. Check the glove. Uh, even the cloves is in there. And like this you could serve it how you like it and then voila this is your ham and then okie dokie let me put this here let me get rid of this okay let's reveal it together one two three i really don't know wow beautiful check it out see all that I will let it rest and then turn it and take a picture and show it to you. I'm going to put this five minutes. Let the cake rest. As you know, when it started coming off from the side, that means that the cake is ready to eat it. Yes, this is done as well. So, I just wanted to come and let you guys know about Tupperware Facebook parties. We do have a Facebook parties. We could do it. Let me know. You could earn a lot. October is the very good month for Tupperware for you. And the hostess gets a lot of gifts. Just text me. Send me a message. We could do it. It takes one from your home. You sit in your home. I sit in my, here in my office. We could do Tupperware party. And if you need some extra income 
for Christmas? Anytime. Money is always anytime. Then you could you could become a member as well too. It's a we call it the membership. There is a three kind of a membership. One membership is that you just it's twenty dollar, eighty dollar, or one twenty. Depends what which one would you like. And um, did I forget anything, Donald? How do people contact you? Uh, so you could uh, send me a message on my webpage is rootdd.ca or you could give me a call 647-282-4386 and I could service you all over Canada and um, and Toronto as well too and just let me know and I will take some pictures and post it afterwards meanwhile stay safe happy Thanksgiving give thanks to God because you know what we are very privileged today. Yes, we are. People are in war. They people are in uh, economic crisis. Uh, all everywhere. COVID nineteen. You know, but you know what? Stay strong. Stay home with your family and friends. Stay safe. That's the important part. Have a fantastic day. And see you next Wednesday. Bye now.